Okay, so let's continue with example three, a complex word problem. So writing this down, example three says, in a light display, so like Christmas lights or some festival lights, um, one set of lights flashes every 25 seconds and the other set of light uh, flashes every minute if both sets of lights Uh, are turned on at the same time write down the next time uh, when the two sets of lights flash together Okay, so let's have a reread of this word problem. It's definitely a two star question because you have to read and interpret the problem. And let's highlight any important information. So it says here in a light display, one set of light flashes every 25 seconds. So that's important. And the other set of light flashes every minute. So one is 25 seconds, the other one is every minute. If both sets of lights are turned on at the same time, what is the next time that the two sets of lights blink together again? Okay, so what we need to do, the thinking here now, is that, well, if light number one flashes every 25 seconds, then it flashes at 25 and then 50, because 25 plus 25 is 50, and then the next time it flashes again is 75, and then the next one is 100, etc. So we're trying to look for the multiples of 25 seconds. And we're also trying to look for the multiples of every minute. Now be careful. When we do comparisons, we always need to make sure our units are the same. So here we have seconds, but here we have minutes. So we need to make sure they both have to have the same units before we can make a meaningful comparison. So every minute is 60 seconds long. So we're really considering the multiples of 60 for the second set of light. So the second set of light would flash at 60 seconds and then at 120 seconds because that's the next multiple of 60. And we're going to keep finding the multiples of 25 and 60 so that we find the first common number, the first common multiple that they have in common. So let's write that down. So we need multiples of light one flashes of light one flashes. So light one flashes every 25 seconds. So 20 for first, 25 times one is one, 25 times two is 50, 25 times three is 75, 25 times four is 100, and then 125, and then 150, and then 175, and then 200, and then 225, and then 250, and then 275, and then 300, and then we have 325, 370, whoops, 350, and then we have 375, and then 400, etc. Now remember, there are infinitely many multiples because numbers go on forever. Uh, let's have a look at the multiples of light 2 and see if there's any common multiples between 25 and 60. I'm trying to find the first common multiple between our lists. So English word equals, we're looking at multiples of light number 2. 
Now remember, we're not counting every one. Well, we're not counting one as one minute because that's not the same units. We're doing 60 seconds. So we're trying to find a multiples of 60. Um, so one, 60 times 1 is 60, 60 times 2 is 120, 60 times 3 is 180, and then 240, and then 300, and then 360, and then 420, and then a 480, and so on, because again, multiples go on forever. So look at your two list. Is there a common multiple which you can see so far. If you can't see it, then you might need to keep listing out the multiples until you find a common one. But if you do look hard enough, you see that in common we have 300. So that's the first common multiple between our two lists. This common multiple, this first common multiple is something that we call the lowest common multiple because common, they occur together, and it's the smallest one that occurs the same in both lists. So the lowest common multiple is 300. So that tells us that the next common flash time for the two sets of lights is equal to 300 seconds. Now, units is very important. We're talking... 300 seconds, not 300 elephants, 300 seconds. Now let's convert this to minutes because it makes sense to talk about it in minutes. If we divide by 60, because there's 60 seconds in a minute, so that gives us five. So that's five minutes. So because this was a word problem, let's finish off with a sentence conclusion. So therefore, the next time the two lights flash together is at five minutes after turning the lights on. And finish the sentence with a full stop. So again, be careful of units, and you're looking for the common multiple between your two sets of multiples.